Hello and welcome, I am Marumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Freddy Gar. So we have 40 bucks now. It's been a few years. Um, we're not very diplomatic. Our liege does not like us. Thinks I'm a traitor. Um, I, I think he's a jerk. Uh, let's try to improve relations with him. Maybe that'll change his willingness to just sit us, let us go. Training troops still does make sense, I think. That's, that's what you're doing, right? Good. Okay. Um, collecting taxes? I don't know. I mean, 25... It does make a difference, and there is a chance we could get a tithe, which would get us out early. On the other hand, Survey Province could be far more effective. Let's have him um, actually build a spy network in our Alicia's capital. Sorry, yeah, build spy network so we can pos potentially uncover some corruption and then uh, get a bribe. Unfortunately, there are no Jews to expel. Damn Jews, why aren't they here? We need some Jews in this country. So we can expel them. <laughs> we need money. Let us out. Just let me out of prison. I want out of prison. For those who don't know, that's a reference to Vanilla CK2. It's not just me being an anti-Semite. Don't click this button. Don't don't click any buttons that cost money. Open employment list. Summon the Dark Brotherhood against my enemy. No. Oh, I've got one gold for 25 military points. I uh, all right for one gold. Yeah. It's just a couple months. That's a pretty good deal. Nice job, my liege. My success, my mission has uh, been a success. I have managed to make him understand what a benevolent and peaceful ruler you really are, and he sends his regards. See, I'm totally not a traitorous bastard. Totally not a traitor. Not a traitor. Let me out. <laughs> Let me out. I will be your marshal this time. I, I will. Look at this. I got 30 damn marshal, and I'm sitting in prison. I'm such a, like, he's just, just such an epic character. He's strong, tall, Nord, Raider, brave. <laughs> he's so good. Let me fight. My boys are being raised by others. They're not becoming what they're supposed to be. I, this, he became a slob. A kind, honest, what the crap is this? Make him a fighter. Beat him. Smack him in the face a bit. Give him some scars and stuff. And this one's fashionable. Oh, God. If I'm not out by the time they turn 16 or whatever, 15, whenever they become of age in this mod, I'm going to be really disappointed. Let me out! I must get out. My courtier's dead. <clears throat> okay, well, here's what it is. Jala. She's not bad. We have 325 levy of a potential 390. So I think we need to probably do a double raid on somebody again. Ideally, if this character like runs out of troops, or if we are able to put together an army that's substantial enough to actually handle hers, then we can go loot this town, this uh, bishopric. That's a bishopric. I know it doesn't really look like one, but that's a castle. That's a bishopric. That's a city. Ooh, that's a city. Uh, it started as an uneasiness around guests and strangers in prison, then evolved into awkwardness and a strong feeling of discomfort in prison. Okay, I don't want to meet any new people in prison, or I'll just have to be more gregarious in prison. <laughs> I'm in prison! Well, we don't want to be shy, so let's check that one. Didn't actually matter. A gemstone deposit during... Awesome! See, that's why you do it. Gemstone deposits until 3413. 34? Holy crap. That's 30 years of plus one plus three tax income. And we still have the Dwemer ruins, so that's like plus total my goodness. This thing makes more money than a city does. Or well, yeah. Base tax on a city is eight. This one does eight point seven five. Sweet! Now we're going to collect taxes. I mean we could could hold out and hope that we get like mithril deposits or even something else, you know. I think that's actually the first time I've ever seen gemstone deposits. 
That's only a 1% chance per year. That's pretty rare. Alright, so now we should be making... Yeah, check it out. Look at that. We're only two years away. Freedom! I feel like yelling it, except that I've got this, you know, cold, sore throat and all that. Be like in Braveheart where, you know, he's like strapped to the thing and they're about to rip him into pieces and he's just, yeah, freedom! Or whatever. It's also the thing that they do on the Dave Ramsey phone calls. Oh, local revolt risk just went up. That's fun. Fortunately, um, even though negative 1.5 plus 5 is definitely more than 0, it's still displaying as 0. Oh, no. It updated. Well, actually... Where I come from, 5 plus 5 is 10, and if you subtract 1.5 from that, it'd be 8.5. But for some reason, it's at 3.8. Don't ask me. I mean, I, the math, it, it boggles the mind. But whatever. All right, who are you at war with now, my liege? Ooh, that guy over there? All right. Does she have any men? I want to go beat her up again. We have 390. Oh, we could almost take her. We could definitely get this one since she's separate. Wait a minute. This is Sky March. What is Sky March doing? Oh, you're attacking her. Perfect. Raise up the army. Let's go looting. We're gonna loot this city. And this bishop. Well, this bishopric. As soon as she goes over here, this must be her army. Scar Hammer? Yeah, look at that. She's already got it raised. Which means that her castle's undefended. Ha! Yes, go commit your troops to this army here. You want to fight him. Of course you do. Go fight each other. Stop dancing around. What are you two doing? Don't be chickens. Alright, while you two are dancing, I'm going to loot this thing. Adventurers have been attracted to our realm as of late. Attracted by tales of ancient ruins or wild bands of monstrous creatures. They better not break anything. Local tax modifier plus 5%. Sweet. More money. We still do need to get rid of the highway. Uh, no, we don't. Apparently the highway robbers or whatever went away. Okay, well, because she's occupied with her war, I think we'll actually be able to just safely burn her fisher brick to the ground, which will probably allow us to get ourselves released. We had at war happen to us. Uh, national revolt risk goes up, taxes go down. So revolt risk is yeah, it's kind of kind of high. Uh, ooh, a strange chest made of an unknown metal was recovered by your men while they looted the building. Try as they might, they haven't been able to force the chest open, and its contents remain a mystery. It has now been deposited into your care. Okay, fine. Let's uh, un undo this now, and I will burn it down again. Because, you know, it's just... Desperate times call for desperate measures. Let me out, let me out, let me out! Oh my god, we got it! We can do it! Let me out, 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 let me out. I have money! Oh god. You son of a bitch. He's never gonna let me out. He's never, ever, ever going to let me out because I have claims on his titles. How about you, like, how about I voluntarily give up my claim to your damn title? Oh, you stupid bastard. He's not going to let me out. We're going to burn her holding down now, too. Just to spite her. Why can't we talk a looter? Have we been in our own territory? Alright. Alright, let's just disband. Oh, we have the money, and now he's just gonna say no. There's gotta be a decision somewhere, like escape from prison. Come on. Open decisions. Employment list. I mean, my goodness is being in prison. I, uh... Friends and rivals. Here are the people that are of importance to me. No one. 
The Dragonborn is not me. It's this 45-year-old, ugly-as-hell woman. Dragonborn's a pretty sweet trait, though. Alright, so... Okay, um... I guess we just have to hope that this guy lets us out eventually, or, I don't know, maybe he dies, or... We can't plot to kill him, I mean, we could try to assassinate him. Send a novice assassin. She should totally do it. It's just not fair that he won't let me out! Let me out! Hmm. Hmm. We'll see. Give me your thoughts on this, because I am pretty frustrated with this already, actually. Here's what I'm thinking. For the sake of roleplay, and for entertainment, and for not being bored out of my mind, um, if we don't see some sort of a turn of events here soon, I might... Might, emphasis might, depending on um, your, your thoughts and your opinions, be persuaded to use the console to have Fredegar rip these bars apart and, like, not be in prison anymore. You know, just say, like, okay, well, because he's got 30 Marshall, he just, just gets himself out of prison. Sound good? Sounds good. It can be done. I'll have to, um, I'll have to think about it. Let me know what your thoughts are. I mean, I don't want to spend... I mean, there's two videos now. We've just been sitting around in prison. I was hoping that he'd let me out. He's just such an asshole. And my son became a battle mage. Are you that... I mean, what... What does... <sighs> what were you thinking? Well... All right, um... Let's arrange your betrothal with that attractive 15-year-old. We what? Oh, my liege is at war with you? I need that woman. Hackneer is no longer steward. All right. So money doesn't make any difference. He's just not willing to let me go. Hmm. The other option would be, um, you know, like if we did, we can't. We can't even declare it to war. I mean, we just can't even declare war on him. We can't do anything. What if we start a, a faction, and then we just fire the faction? We probably can't. Yeah. And even if we could, he'd probably still have us in prison, which would mean he'd just win automatically. Which means that there's no point! We would just end up being killed. My my heir is now a slob and he's ill. Well, let's find you an attractive 15 or 16 year old. Who's probably now already been married off to somebody else. Well, she's strong, you're strong, make... Oh, God, don't tell me you're both married. What, we're at war again? Um, do we want to be King Roth? Or do we want to be patient? See, patience... You don't have the marshal, but... This is overall a better trait. I think we go for Roth. <laughs> Fredegar's bulking up. He's getting he's getting angry for being in prison. Let me out. When he gets to like 33 strength, 33 martial, just rip the bars open. We had at war happen to us. We had let me the hell out of prison. Just because I have this... I didn't even... Like, I didn't know I was going to start the game with this claim. I didn't expect to start the game with this claim. I don't want this claim. Like, I do, but I don't want it now. I just went out of prison. Um... What's this crap? Skeever. 
How come I'm not getting pop-ups about skeevers, trolls, and exhausted forests? When did this happen? What is happening? I am not getting pop-ups about these events. We have skeevers until 3389, one year. This is for two years. Trolls. And then exhausted forests. A survey has revealed the forests to be exhausted. Minus two taxing them until two more years. Is someone else surveying my lands or something? I don't think he can. Weird. Very strange. Alright. Um, desert expert. Let's find our son a wife, and then... Alright, so my son is strong and tall. Genius would be nice. Count Arcadio is not at war with Thane Fredegar. Pretty sure we're not at war. Pretty sure. Oh, I, I just I can't even arrange marriages when I'm in prison, apparently. You can't do anything in this game when you're in prison. My god. Ugh. And then here it just inaccurately says must not be at war. Interesting. Okay. Alright, well, I've... Okay. Give me your thoughts, but I've pretty much already made up my mind. If I can't arrange the marriages of my kids, I can't declare war on anyone, I can't even start a faction, I can't declare war on my liege, I can't do anything at all. All because of this claim. Okay, okay, wait, wait, okay. Here's what we'll do. This is a better solution. I'm going to get rid of my claim. I'm not going to just get out of prison. I'm going to get I'm going to ditch the claim and then that way he should allow us to pay our way out. So we'll do that. So thanks for watching everyone. I'm going to take a break here and when we come back our claim will have been I'm voluntarily giving up my claim. So thanks for watching everyone. See you again soon.